Well, this Tony Award winning actress and singer got to flex all of her talents on the biggest, uh, one of the biggest shows on cable, Cody Snowpiercer Stark. Standing by with more details. That's right, uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, joining us now, the great and wondrous Lena Hall. Hello, uh, Lena. You're great and wondrous. Oh, yourself. oh, stop it. Oh, <laughs> stop it. Okay, did I do this? Did I do this? Because I think the first time we interviewed, I, I was talking about your singing on the show, and I said they should release these songs. And now, magically, it's happened. So I'm going to take credit for it. Uh, you can go ahead and take credit for it. A lot of people, every time I would sing a song, they would be like, I can't find this on Spotify. Where is it? You need to release it. So eventually, I just went ahead and recorded them with my producer, Justin Craig, here in New York, and released my own album of all of the songs nice. I've done on Snowpiercer so far. And um, two of the songs, actually, I didn't do, but were big character moments, and I wanted to include them on there because... I love my character and I love the show. Yeah, Miss Audrey, who can't? She's so complicated. I love that character. Now, if people <laughs> at home are saying, well, "What are you talking about, Cody and Lena?" Uh, here, let's play a little clip of, uh, of Miss Audrey singing here on the show. Yes! Oh my goodness! <laughs> By the way, uh, there's a large animal over your shoulder. I don't know if that animal's uh, supposed to be there. It's in the wild. That's my dog, Dini. Oh, okay. And she was like, she would either completely get in my face right now, or she wants to just be out there. <laughs> Usually she's running around in the woods, but for some odd reason, she's like just hanging out around here. It's like she knows I'm doing an interview and just wants to be in it. Fantastic, fantastic. But she's a Great Dane, like Zeus, who just, uh, the, the world record Great Dane, who uh, oh. who's like the biggest Great Dane ever. Yeah. yeah. She's huge. She's like, a, she's like a small mountain range. Yes, she is. <laughs> she is, yes. Uh, if so I was me, a little shorter, I could ride her like a, a pony. <laughs> like a pony. Uh, let me ask you this. Do, do you, uh, who, who picks out the songs? Do you have a part in that or, or what? Uh, uh, we have an amazing um, music department on the show. Natasha Dupree is one of the people who helps license all the songs. And basically, it's just a joint combination of me, the showrunner, um, the director, and uh, Natasha. So ah, okay. it's a it's a group pick. The first season, I didn't actually have much of a say in what the songs were, and then second season and third season, they they really came to me for my input. Although my input was usually never <laughs> never used. <laughs> I, I would suggest a bunch of songs and they were like, no. And then they would come back with a list of these amazing songs and most of them I had never heard. And so uh, from that list of songs, then I would choose like my favorites and then we'd all just whittle it down and, uh, and from there. So uh, my original choices were really <laughs> never <laughs> <laughs> That's like, it's just like working here. I, I throw out all sorts of interesting <laughs> stuff. They're like, yeah, yeah, whatever. Um, uh, let me ask you about uh, the cover of Glory Box by Portishead. It's probably my favorite on there. Now, at a certain point in the song, your voice gets overmodulated because that's the way the song goes. But I was wondering if, uh, if that just happens naturally because we don't have the technology to contain your vocals. They're so <laughs> powerful. Um, I do something uh, that I didn't know existed. I apparently self-compress my voice um, when I sing. It's this thing I do. I don't even know, but uh, music producers are like, you somehow you self-compress your voice. It's really crazy. Um, and uh, no, but we, we use some overdrive on my voice just yeah. to get cool. that, you know, kind of something else in that moment of like, it's like a really emotional moment and I love the song because the song reflects a very emotional moment for my character oh. and um, and uh, yeah, I, uh, it, it was really fun to record and, and I really wanted to make sure that I honored all the songs that I cover but as well do my own thing with them and it's never, it's never a competition to who has the best version of the song, right? I, I always tell people, please Go listen to the original versions, especially Love and Hate by Errol Benjamin. Cool. He does an incredible um, acoustic version that's on YouTube. And that was totally what inspired us to do, to cover that song. Oh, it's so good. Both versions yeah. are great. Both versions yeah. are great. Okay, uh, where can <laughs> folks get this? Uh, anywhere, Spotify, iTunes, Amazon Prime. I think you can even use it on TikTok and, and, and like Instagram. I think they're all out there. 
Um, and yeah, you can either um, listen to it on a streaming service or you can purchase it. Do people purchase music anymore? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, that sucks for the artist because we don't see any money from streaming. But, uh, but as, uh, if, if you want to support artists more, please buy their music on uh, iTunes or CDs or whatever. But um, I'm old. not releasing a hard co copy oh, okay. of this yet. Okay. All right. Maybe I will. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. By the way, where do you keep the Tony? Where is it? It's in New York. I mean, currently I'm in Connecticut, but um, it's in New York, and it's in this beautiful bookshelf. <laughs> Not that interesting, I guess. <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> I love it, and I spin it. Thank you, Lena. Love you. Thank you. Love your voice. Love you, you are amazing. <laughs> and I always, I mean, like, seriously, I love talking to you about this stuff. I can't wait for the next season of Snowpiercer. I know you just finished, but I can't wait for the next season. Next season, season four, it's going to be a doozy. All right. Thanks, Lena. Bye. Bye. She's so